Welcome again to another episode of New Parenting Training. So today's episode is going to be two products that I got recently. And so we got the Infant to Toddler Rocker, and this is from our friend Jennifer. Thank you, Jennifer. And then we have the Baby Bjorn, and this is from a gift from my mom and my sister. Instead of doing a video each one of them separately, we're just going to unbox them together. And so let's get to it. So I'm going to start off with the Infant to Toddler Rocker, unbox it, and to, to assemble it. We're going to do the same thing for this product as well. And after that, we're going to do a review. So Jacob and I, we're going to re review each one of them and see the pros and cons of each one. So let's get to it. no instruction manual
That's it. All right, so we already have the baby boyron bouncer here, and Jacob is trying or testing it. Um, at the beginning, he didn't really like it, but I think as he grows, uh, he seems to enjoy it even more. You know, one of the things that he likes it the most, you know, this one is like a baby power bouncer. It doesn't require battery, so when he moves, the bouncer moves, and if we want to give him more motion, we would just do like this. And there's three different settings as we show a little bit in the video. He likes the setting that is upright the most because especially when he has some sort of acid reflux or gassiness, it helps me to helps him to be sitting upright. The other thing he likes it, well, not us, but he probably does, is that this bouncer it really helps him to stimulate his bowels. I guess it's the position that he's in, um, that gives a comfortable position for him to do number two. And every time he uses, he does number two. Just be careful because it could soil this, this bouncer. And he has already done it at least once. So we usually put um, an extra fabric or we have a really, really good diaper <laughs> to avoid the soiling of the fabric. And speak of the fabric, this fabric is really easy to wash. And all you have to do is just to slide it up and then just throw it to the uh, washing machine. It's also very uh, breathable fabric. There's a mesh like that allows the air to ventilate. The other thing about this fabric is, uh, according to this box, it's safe. It says here that contains no added flame retardants, no flame retardant chemicals, kind to baby skin, and it's also kind and safe to taste. That's what they say on the box. And this bouncer, you could use it from their newborn all the way to two years old. He's right now six weeks. And I think the minimum that he needs to weigh, I believe, is 8 pounds up to 29 pounds. And so this bouncer can actually last for a long time, not just three months. <laughs> we plan to keep it in the case that he actually needs it for a longer period. So this bouncer is great, and, and, that's the, and that's the sense that he is enjoying it and easy to clean. The other thing is also very portable. You know, you just fold it and you store it. I also seen parents that they carry with them when they're traveling to the airplane, to the car. Um, and it's not an, an eyesore. Like they, they have really nice colors, muted colors. So we chose some very neutral colors, but they come with different colors. Uh, like there's blue, there's white, there's different gray colors. And so there's a lot of whole selection. It is sold through Amazon, uh, Bye Bye Baby. I also seen it in Bed Bath and Beyond as well. Cost for each of these stories costs one hundred ninety nine dollars. But if you have if you have a twenty percent coupon from Bye Bye Baby or Bed Bath and Beyond, you could get you could save twenty percent of that. And not only that, but you could also use the website Rakuten that could give you four percent cash back. The one thing about this one um, that I wish they came with is a toy bar. So they sell the toy bar that goes across. But the toy bar is really expensive. It's like $60. And they have a really good reviews about it. We're not sure yet if we're going to buy it. But I think he's happy where he's at with the bouncer. But if, otherwise, if he starts being playful, then we probably will consider to buy the toy bar. Bless you. All right. So what do you think about the bouncer? You like it? Yes? He feels really relaxed, by the way, because he just had a poop and we didn't film it. So we're now going to go forward and talk about the next one. So this is a Fisher Price, the infant to toddler rocker. And as you can see now, the baby is really, really, really sleepy and he fell asleep while rocking it. So this is great if you need to soothe the baby to sleep. And so this has helped to do that. A little bit about the rocker. This rocker doesn't, doesn't self rock. So you have to move it. And sometimes if the baby is fussy and he moves himself, this one can also move itself, but it doesn't move that, that that's as high of a motion. As far as for assembly, this needs to be assembled. And it was pretty easy, very straightforward, as long as you follow the instructions. The only part that actually struggled was to align the bar here that connects um, these two parts. So the bar part was the harder issue for me to assemble. Besides the rocker that is great, which is just very similar to the bouncer, is that you could put the baby into the rocker, you could just leave him alone, and you could just wash dishes, you could clean, you could just go to the bathroom really quickly and come back. 
and he's just still be there. So this, the rocker and the bouncer is just great for babies to be stationary and they're not going anywhere. And besides the rocker, there is this bar that you could position. And that is a fold-out kickstand that makes a stationary seat and it's great for feeding or napping. So obviously when you're feeding, make sure this one is a little more upward or less of a incline, so more of a recline. This one came with a bar, so you don't have to buy it separately. The toy bar came with the box. And so this is really good for play with for play um, for the baby and engage him to play. And it comes with different colors. As far as for price, there is a range and you can find that in Amazon. And in a, depending on the design, it can be as low as $29 or up to $44.99. Let's see what other things it talks about. So it says here it has secured three-point restraint, just very, very light to the baby by yarn, that you could restrain the baby for safety. And oh, it also has a machine washable pad. So this one is also easy to remove. So you just have to unclip it from here and just take it, take it out and throw it to a washer machine. And one thing I almost forgot is there is this little soother or vibration that can actually provide the vibration so that it calms the baby and comfort the baby and soothe the younger babies the one thing about the this um rocker it does not come with the battery so you need to buy the battery separately in order to power the vibration part and the battery is an interesting size it's a c battery and that's something that you could actually find in a regular store so it requires two c batteries and this rocker it goes up to 40 pounds so compared to the um, bouncer this one could actually fit uh, older kids and could be just using as a chair if it's not a rocker so just to recap i have reviewed these two products and it seems that our baby likes them both the baby boy yarn one of the great benefits of this is that it's really portable easy to assemble and easy to store and travel with it. The downside of it is really expensive. It's close to $200. About the, the rocker, this one is less expensive. It could go up to $44.99. It came, comes with a toy bar and it has either a, a, a stationary position or it has a rocker position that could help the baby to suit to sleep. The downside about it is that it's not as easy to assemble compared to this one because this one just took a few seconds and it's not as portable or easy to carry around and here are my reviews and if you find this video to be helpful and useful and you like it don't forget to click the like button and also don't forget to subscribe and we would love to hear your comments for any other products that you have tried that you would like us to review as well until next time bye bye